everybody welcome to Savi's palette my name is Savita and uh, today I wanted to show you two different dishes using this green papaya and this is currently one of my favorite vegetables and I love salad it's super easy to make and super flavorful and I'm also going to make some fries air fried fries from this green papaya and I'll show you how I do that and uh, let's go ahead and get started so for the salad, I actually love to use green beans and uh, French style green beans. And my favorite green beans to use is this from Trader Joe. I absolutely love this. And uh, the beans are nice and thin. And once they thaw, they are so fresh and still so tasty and sweet. So this actually works perfectly in the papaya salad. So I'm just gonna take a handful of this out and let it thaw while I go ahead and prep the other ingredients. Uh, you don't need a lot, you just need a few to keep it that nice crunch. And see how it is. So I'm going to cut it into a half and take out all the seeds. And we're going to go ahead and grate these. Uh, using a regular box crater, but this gives the best size. This is the kind of grate you get. So perfect and not too thin, not too thick. And this works best for the salad. So we'll just use one of these carrots in our salad. I have grated half of it, so I'm gonna go ahead and grate the other half. There's the grated papaya, grated carrots. So I'm going to add just a few uh, grape tomatoes here. I'm going to chop them, cut them into quarters and then add them. Uh, I think that's a good amount. So now I have my main vegetables all ready. I'm going to go ahead and make the dressing and I use a mutter and pestle here for that. So before I do the actual dressing, I have some salted peanuts here. I'm just going to go ahead and break them up into smaller pieces for me to use in the salad step is totally optional you can use whole peanuts or you can powder peanuts through other methods I just think it's easier since I'm going to be using this anyway so now to make the dressing take one garlic I kind of chopped up into pieces so it gets easier to crush it I take one green chili you're welcome to take more I just think this is good enough spice for me depends on the level of spice you want half a lemon I'm going to go ahead and add this coconut brown sugar, about a teaspoon of it. We're going to crush this up all together. So now that it's all mashed together, I'm going to add just about half a teaspoon of tamari soy sauce. I use tamari because it's gluten free. We'll also add half a teaspoon of rice vinegar just to give that zing, just a little. Mix it all up. Oh, I almost forgot to add the green beans. So here it is thawed and the water is drained out. I'm going to roughly chop them up into one third. And they are nice and thin and they are really, really nice crunchy. My cilantro. To get it all together, we're going to add the dressing. And then I'm going to just go ahead and mix it kind of like, kind of get crushed together. Oh, almost forgot. Let's add some Himalayan salt. It very gently with this pestle really brings all the flavors together. There you have it, it's all ready to be served. The delicious yum yum green papaya salad is ready. This salad tastes really, really yummy when it is cold. So let me just wrap this up and stick it into the refrigerator for about half an hour. Okay, this half of the papaya, I'm going to make green papaya fries, air fries. So I'm actually going to use my a mandolin slicer which actually makes this really good julienne strips 
So the mandolin sizer gives a nice even um, fries. See this size? So let's move all the chopped papaya fries into a, a bowl. So to this, we're going to add some spices and marinate it. So the spices go in. Start by adding about three teaspoons of olive oil, half a teaspoon chili powder, half teaspoon salt, and let's just toss it all together so all the pieces get coated with the spices and the oil. Okay, let this sit for about 20 to 30 minutes. Okay, this has been sitting for about 20 minutes now. The nice thing about the green papaya is that it doesn't have a lot of moisture. It really works great for an air fryer. So now let's just toss it into the air fryer basket and spread it nice and even. All right, let's pop this in for 15 minutes at 375. Let's go ahead and dress up the Tom Yum green papaya salad and look how fresh and yummy it looks. And it has taken in the flavors. Let's sprinkle some crushed peanuts on top. Put it off with a couple of sprigs of cilantro and your amazing Tom Yum green papaya salad is ready. And we're gonna give this a quick taste soon. All right, out comes the fries and this is how the pumpkin fries look. Perfectly cooked. Have some nice homemade mint chutney to go with the fries. I'm going to serve myself a good heaping helping of this salad. I'm going to top it off with more peanuts because I like lots of peanuts in my salad. Some fries on the side. First the salad. Mm -mm -mm. It is so good. All the flavors are perfect. You could cut down on the green chilies if you want to. Um, use half instead of one, but this is extremely tasty and delicious. It's super easy. You can do variations on your vegetables, but I like this set of vegetables which go very well together. The dressing, you can vary it. Uh, one other dressing I have done is see this mint, homemade mint chutney. I add a little bit of white vinegar to this, use this as a dressing and it tastes excellent. Now for the fries. Mm -mm -mm. This is really tasty. The, the chili powder and the salt has really soaked into the papaya. Really, really delicious and very healthy alternative. All are gluten-free, low carb. So the only carb in this is I did add a half teaspoon of uh, coconut sugar. So thank you so much for watching Savi's Palace. Please like, share and subscribe. And hope you get to try both these dishes out. And thank you again.